Okay, this is Admiral Akbar, Power of the Force card with the long photo. So these are unique to Europe. So in Europe, these figures, some of the figures came with long photographs instead of the freeze frame. But these cards just look great. So you get this really great picture of Admiral Akbar on the card with all the different languages there. His collection two figure. Here's the figure. It's not a bad figure really. Some nice paint apps to him. Insignia, hands, yellow stripes on the pants. Back of the card. Other figures available. So this is the sort of card that has been sold on continental Europe, some in the UK as well. Very nice. Just looks great with that long photo. Very nice. So far I've shown the Rike with the long photo as well. I mean I've had these figures for quite a while. I must have got them in about 2011-12 and I never got round to showing them. This is a bit silly on my part. So at least now... I mean they weren't, cheap. They weren't expensive at all, they were really cheap then. There might be a bit more now. Kenner logo. So I'll show you the other Powder Force releases of Admiral Akbar. So that's your more typical Admiral Akbar there. And the green card, then the freeze frame, and then the long photo, which is the one I'm showing you. Just nice to see the variations carded variations bound to be a Canadian card as well yep Canadian freeze frame and Canadian regular card but this is the one we're interested in so instead of putting a freeze frame on the card they just gave us a long photo but I think it makes the figure stand out quite a lot on the card and here it is again Very nice. There's his accessory there, sort of attachable blaster thing. Really, it just needs to have come with a staff. I guess because it's his hands aren't in a gripping position. Admiral Armorante. Great photo on the card though. Most famous one of these is the Luke Bespin. A long photo. Card. So that's Admiral Akbar, long photo. Cheers, goodbye.